everyone, welcome to Kip TV. I am Kip and this heavy is ready to go. So am I. It is Gravel Pit. It is two Highlander teams. It is Silver in UGC North American League. We have 35th Infantry versus Attack on Hue. That is H-U-E. Clever, I know, right? Anyway, on 35th Infantry of Iberonic as Sniper Wave Altitude Cow is Soldier. Uh, Zed Cool is going to be Medic. Donald is Demo Man. Louch 24 is Engineer. Diamond is Scout. Pyre Axe is appropriately. Pyre Spacey is uh, Spy. Kind of appropriate. Spacey Spy. That works. Anyway, Zopper is Heavy. Over on uh, Hugh is what we're going to call him. We have Move Manglia as Sniper. Wesley is Pyro Polk is Medic. Sacred Dragon is Pyro or Soldier. Casual is Spy. Yeah, which I'm pretty sure is CJC. But I'm going to call him Yeah. Because that's what he's tagged up as. Uh, is is uh, Scout Cyan or Cayenne is uh, Demo Man Dell. Conagher is going to be Engineer and Kyla Fox is on Heavy. Let's watch her and her roll out because she is so pumped and ready for this. Got those gloves on. But actually, we want to we want to go the Dell cam, of course. Now he is ready in that jack, and he also has the whip going from Sacred Dragon, so he's going to get out there very fast. So um, like what's going on here, a lot of coordination. Obviously, uh, Polk may be a familiar name to some of you guys. He is uh, Platinum Heavy, but decided to go off-classing and go Medic uh, this season. And uh, you may know Kai the Fox. She's Gold Medic, but she decided to go off-class this uh, this season and uh, go Heavy. So a little switcheroo right there, but they do have um, that experience from both of those sides in. So I I'm guessing they both know their stuff. Dell, also a very good engineer as well, and we'll see what he's got going on here. Looks like the level 3 will be able to get up, so there you go, ladies and gentlemen, that's how you get a level 3 up on A, and a dispenser as well. Uh, we'll see if he does any fancy tricks, but uh, we are on Gravel Pit, it is probably not going to, the action is probably not going to be here on B, um, B first, it will probably be on A. B on A, I hope that didn't confuse you, it confused me. Anyway, uh, we'll get casuals cam as he is just pretty much scoping out right here. Um, nobody defends A unless you're really kinky, uh, which is sometimes fun to see. Uh, try for that, so that strongman defense um, and just let, try not to let the team get any points. But it looks like Hugh, attack on Hugh, is going to give up A appropriately, pretty uh, wisely right here. Looks like Donald went down the double man for 35th, probably trying to force some jump in on uh, A. Not a bad idea. Try to get a bomb in the, on the medic who's usually stationed around the sentry gun. Uh, where is Polk is the question. Actually holding up here right now, so uh, not a bad idea. We'll see if they decide to be aggressive with this Uber that of course is charged and ready to go. Or uh, what they're doing here, because they are actually pushing up here. They want to hold a uh, very far on C, so that's an uh, interesting positioning. Uh, we'll see how it goes. Polk coming out a little bit, taking some damage, and has to fall back there as a medic. Um, not something you want to do, but let's uh, see what's going on here. On uh, 35th side, just a lot of double spam coming across as both teams just trying to feel out of what's going on and what way would be best for uh, for 35th to push right now. Donald seems to think I'm maybe going to bring the team along. Uh, opposite way, but no, he's just going to go by himself and try for some recon. Oh, nope, there he goes. <laughs> it does have the combo with them. They're going to go up C Tower, uh, try to get a different angle on Hugh and Team, or Team Hugh, anyway, Cyan. <laughs> Especially though, because he's uh, just been putting about a bunch of good spam. But they're wasting time. They get a nice time on a 43 seconds, I think is probably fastest you can up to the fastest you can go right there. Um, but so far they have been very timid in pushing A. Um, and I'm not sure, they're just waiting for some good positioning, they're waiting to get a pick, they're waiting, they're waiting though, that's the problem right here. Um, time is ticking, every second counts in a stopwatch match. Like Gravel Pit, they do finally get a little bit of positioning here, Donald pushing in, taking down, um, putting in some sticky spacey, and Ironic, the sniper went down right there, uh, so no sniper coverage, um, and Donald looks like he wasn't even going to commit to that. Um, we do have Zopper though getting dropped, Cyan had a nice sticky trap, take out the enemy, Heavy and uh, Zed Cool not able to pull the trigger in that, maybe not willing to because he wasn't uh, surrounded with his uh, his other heavier classes um, in order to make an effective push. So right now we're just having a little standoff here on Gravel Pit. 
Let's try to see what we can um, in terms of. We do have uh, interesting. Uh, Altitude count is running that direct hit, and Ibaronic is uh, holding down that spawn right there. But uh, not too many people are going to spawn because Red really hasn't lost too many. All right, finally we do have some action as both Ubers are popped. Blue first, and Red is going to last significantly longer. But oh, down goes Kai. She gets air blasted off the. Uh, balcony right there and we'll go down. Red is gonna have to fall back to that center gun Oh, which takes a bunch of stickies and it goes down right there Donald with some nice spam And he's actually continuing pulling up on that but ironic takes down Kai and Kai uh, Without that or I'm sorry poke without that protection of Kai is uh, screwed She's got an engineer and a sniper. We'll see if she's a he's able to survive this dang nabbit Kai is oh, oh it's gonna mess me up so much. I'm sorry for I'm sorry Kai and Polk. I'm sorry Oh, but down goes Polk uh, diamond right in there getting a nice pick uh, that scout of course uh, Dell is all alone right now trying to make something happen right here does get that kill on Donald uh, we'll see He's going to try to set up here again, which is uh, probably the right choice because uh, right now Red is getting those respawns, so Hugh will probably be able to get something up here. Um, Blue not having a lot of time right there. You do see the dead body, but of course dead bodies do not cap points. Uh, I don't know if you knew that, but uh, yeah, today you learned. Uh, anyway... We'll see. Uh, let's just look at some positioning from Red right here because, like I said, they have some very experienced players on this team, so they know their positioning. Um, even though Gravel Pit hasn't been played in a couple seasons, everybody knows how to play it in Highlander. Cyan actually uh, getting headshot right there, so ironic with a nice pick. Uh, oh, I want to get on his cam, but Casual right now is in an interesting position, and he could be fun to watch too. I think they know where he is, and they should be able to hear that knife clicking, but uh, of course they don't. Yeah, they are very, very suspicious right now. Oh my goodness. Casual has got to be super, super patient, but some nice spy checking going on from Wes, or from, uh, sorry about that, from Pyro. Um, I'm sorry, not paying attention to what's going on. 35th Medic did drop right there because, oh, Casual gets the pick on Ironic. Uh, oh my goodness. I'm trying to read the kill feed and I'm trying to. Sorry, sorry. I'm so out of practice. It's been a week. But anyway, uh, Blue did drop their medis. Polk has this 100% Uber, and they're going to come in just in time. He needs to pop it before it goes. He doesn't. He drops Kai. He drops Kai, and now there is just nothing to do right here. He Ubers the spy. Needs to just get out of there. Oh, God. I don't know if he knew that there, the entire team was on the point right there. Oh, and there's Sapper going down. Uh, meanwhile, these snipers are having a field day. We'll have to get on their camera. Right, move Manglia. I'm just going to call Move. I uh, had a nice pick right there. Oh, uh, and taking down Ibaronic with a sweet headshot. Uh, and it looks like somehow, some way, Hugh is still uh, is still holding on to this point. Uh, Blue was not able to come up. Another nice shot right there. And now he's going to be able to get the sentry gun. Uh, poor little sentry gun. Yep, there he goes. Oh, Sacred Dragon got the kill. Sacred Dragon. Uh, so a big lost opportunity for Blue. They had a great opportunity just um, when Kai going down and Polk having to use that Uber on a spy. Uh, they really could have uh, done something right there. Separate the medic from the rest of his team. Take down Polk because right now Polk is going to have about 20% Uber advantage. Um, not, you know, anything significant except especially, especially when they're on a defense. Um, but we'll see Moof getting another headshot on Ibaronic. So Ibaronic having a hard time staying up right now. Moof having a good time uh, shooting his head though. So we'll get on the Moof cam. Oh, but in comes Sacred Dragon trying to get the med. But some nice sticky traps by Donald right there. And I'm pretty sure that is Donald Trump. Trumpet. Donald Trumpet. Not Donald Trump, but he used to play for uh, 35th uh, when I first started casting them. They do have this Uber ready to go. Oh, Zed does get the pop off. Not the position they wanted to be in. And Donald is trying to do something right here to save his medic. Uh, take it down that pyro, possibly. But oh, the mailbox is out. And we'll see if Donald can finish this off. But uh, oh, Zed gets taken down by CJC right there. That is, yeah. And, uh, Actually, Zed or um, Polk went down as well. Oh, I'm sorry, that was Polk who went down, and then Zed went down as well. I apologize about that, but that was a kind of foregone conclusion because he was a medic with nowhere to go. Uh, Donald somehow survived that. He's gonna fade back into the bottom BC uh, BC connector, and uh, I guess just try to stay alive. No, he's gonna get some recruits from his friends, and uh, we'll get those uh, fast heals. Um, as it looks like 
red Hugh not still not giving this up and Donald overextended just a little bit right there as who came in from behind it looks like that was casual um, but he goes down as Cyan is uh, he goes down as uh, the rest of the team um, patrolling that uh, uh, that tunnel now that we did lose Zed Polk though has a nice little uber row he's getting super super hurt right now but gets that health with only 60 seconds left and B is not capped. This is so not good for 35th. They know they have to make something happen right here. And right now, Lelouch is trying to make it happen all by himself. But he goes down. He does have this mini center on the point, uh, which could be significant. He needs to get some presence. His team needs to get some presence on the point. And finally, they do get... Uh, you get who's that diamond diamond there on the point and the rest of the team joins him it looks like this will probably be it um oh man ironic knows where that sniper is coming we'll see if uh Hugh can do anything to stop this cap but it's going to probably go to 35th barring another uber or some sort of act of god but doesn't look like god is in in the house in the house yeah god is not in the house i'm sorry God has left the house. All right, so let's uh, check out what Dell has got going on here. He has, does have that mini sentry out, so he's not going to go for a strong uh, level three defense here, but he does have that teleport. He's upgrading it, so I'm guessing it goes up here. It does go up here on the roof, so a nice teleportation. Teleportation will get his uh, team the height advantage. Meanwhile, Uber is popped. Oh, some nice flashing around right there, and down it goes. Kai Polk is going to be finished off right here, no doubt. Oh my god, he's still alive. Finally, he gets body shotted down, and Blue have a really, really nice push right here. It's just poor Dell all alone. He does get a few hits on the med, but not going to be enough, and that will be a fast round. Uh, fast cap of C. So what uh, looked like was going to be a really long round turns out to a 9 minutes and 23 seconds. It's not terrible, but it's not real. It's not good. Uh, an average time on gravel pit will be about six six minutes, seven minutes. Um, that cap on B took way too long for 35th, and uh, they know they have to put up some stellar defense here in order to uh, to force in order to um, create a long time for for Hugh. Now we're seeing the opposite approach of building here on B, which is get to the point and get suicides and then um, build your stuff up. And then also it looks like we are going to see some sentry jump in. Oh yeah, I love to see that. Nothing like uh, taking some bullets for the team. But uh, yeah, so Lelouch getting out there and uh, doing a nice job instead of just building it at spawn and then getting whipped up. He's got a... Uh, level one about everything and teleport and everything ready to go but uh, hopefully he doesn't get bombed immediately because oh oh the uber was popped <laughs> I'm thinking that was an accident um, they may have time to rebuild but oh god here comes the jumps in oh my goodness and the center gun goes down that's what I was worried about but Sion gets taken down to an air shot from altitude count nice pick right there uh, in comes Kai she is all alone but she does go down altitude count again with that pick looks like there's gonna be a very strong push here for B immediately uh, I love it from Hugh but uh, they did lose a lot of players right there and they just got extremely lucky that uh that red accidentally popped the uber zed still alive so uh, we'll see what happens here polk looks like is now going to be pushing that with his team he stayed uh, definitely stationary that first part nobody has gotten a yet for hugh and uh, they're looking very very committed to this b push so let's keep an eye on it as Oh, the sentry gun has gone down, Cyan with the nice pills right there. Oh, oh, Cyan with some more stickies, and the boober is finally popped. Um, Polk flashing around very, very nicely. Oh, man, and Pyrax going down in midair to move. Wesley finished eating off Zed, and this is absolute insanity right here. It looks like they're going to go for a simultaneous A and B cap. Will they be able to do it? Hugh is just uh, feeling very confident, but watch your back. Spacey comes in, gets the pick uh, on Wesley. And there's only Donald alive, though, for red. So it looks like this uh, AMB will fastly, rapidly, um, quickly, with great haste, go to Hugh. Uh, 35th, looks like they're still trying to put up some defense on A, maybe? Um, not a bad idea, but who is there for Hugh? And they're just rolling right now. It's uh, Dell. Looks like they left... 
oh, they just, they got the point and then they jumped off there. A little delayed right there on the HUD, but uh, they do have 7 minutes and 30 seconds to get C, which is an incredibly long time. And they also have uber advantage, so things not looking great right now for 35th. We'll see if they can put up a defense. It's definitely possible. C can be very easy to defend if you have a lot of players up here. You gotta stay alive, though. And we'll see what they can do. Let's see, uh, Lelouch is running that mini sentry, so no uh, level 3 to take out. Here comes this uber, they won't have to worry about that level 3, but oh, down comes uh, Zopper, and he goes down to Sacred Dragon. Uh, looks like Medic is all alone, no Medic has a little support from the Engineer, but who can't find the trigger on that. Oh, Rescue Ranger, and we still have some presence here up on top, um, and yet... Yeah, it's Lelouch. Oh no, but then Zed stood on a sticky and that was his undoing, of course. Uh, just absolute chaos on the point right now. Sacred Dragon coming in there trying to get a kill with the whip. Um, but <laughs> he gets air blasted away. We're gonna have some Pyro on Pyro action and boy is it hot. They both air blast each other and it looks like Pyrox was the one to go down. There's shotgun right there. Oh my goodness, Spacey trying to get it, but he goes down. Donald coming up with uh, some stickies. We do have the soldier for 35th on the point but he's got to stay on the point he's got to watch out for ye oh my goodness and the sacred dragon missed that jump right there oh my god this is intense and absolute insanity uh cyan was trying to get in there he had some good pills but goes down to a sweet headshot right there from ironic i don't want to take my eyes off of the point because i know that's where this action is going to happen, but I know Ibaronic is probably doing some really nice work because these sight lines on B or in C have, are so good for snipers. Um, there's a lot of places uh, where they can just stare forever and ever and get those sight lines that they want. Uh, let's see if we can't. Uh, Moof is just trying to deal with this spy right here, so he's not going to have the sight lines he wants. Let's check it on Ibaronic. Uh, as the storm has kind of. Uh, calmed at least for a second right now as Hugh has stopped throwing players onto the point. Uh, ooh, nope. Got the urine down and Donald actually then getting a 2k right there and took down Kai. Uh, Polk was not in that situation so he is still up and charging that Uber. It does have about 20%, uh, 15%. Um, math is hard on really fast. Uh, yeah, that's 20. Okay, well anyway, he's got this 20% Uber um, as Sacred Dragon trying to get some time up there to get a little carrot of blue onto the point, but Polk goes down. I missed that, but I think it was down to fire, so that was Pyroax who um, charged the medic and got the kill right there. Uh, not something you normally see, so that's why if I sound surprised, it's because I am. And how did how did a Pyro get behind Polk? Um, this is the question. But uh, regardless, it stands that Polk is down and Casual is getting some sweet, sweet heals. Uh, I thought for sure he bumped right there. But uh, he did not. Oh, I thought for sure he'd run into fire right there, but he did not. Instead, he's going to probably just give his uh, team... Oh, no! Oh! He's getting the heals again! Really go for the trick jump stab, but not able to pull it off casual. Uh, did succeed in getting lots of heals from the enemy medic, though, and that's not something you're super proud of. Ibaronic, again, getting a headshot. Uh, maybe just the gun that makes him sound super epic, but I feel like his headshots have all been like really epic. We'll uh, peek in right here, see maybe they absolutely are. But uh, again, this is an interesting sight line. So you can get people climbing up the stairs, peeking their heads out, and uh, something about that they will no longer have heads. Anyway, we do have Polk about ready here for uh, another Uber, so let's get on that combos cam for Hugh. Remember, they do have, they had quite a bit of time, but they've wasted about like four or three, four minutes right here. So they have three minutes and 40 seconds left. Uh, here comes the pop. Uber in, uh, Demoman to up top. The red Uber is popped as well. Um, Polk now is all by himself. There's nobody left uh, to say. There you go. Finally getting some support from CJC as uh, action going down on the point. Dell tried to get up there, not able to do so as uh, Lilouch is still alive. Oh, I'm sorry. Dell is over here. But we do have a battle of the mini sentries, and it uh, looks like Lilouch is going to uh, survive. Uh, and his little, little mini sentry that could. Uh, we have the same teleporter presence right here, so. Um, that's the new mem- that's the memo, guys, if you didn't know it. That's where you put your teleporter on uh, C if you're an engineer in Highlander. Oh, uh, Polk is falling down right here with Kai. They don't have any sort of uh, discernible advantage, and in fact, Polk is going to get picked off, like, right now. Yeah, Donald getting some sweet, sweet stickies in there, but Diamond doing a lot of work as Scout with that scatter gun. So, um, not sure what they were doing right there, bringing their combo out, but doesn't matter because Move takes down Zed with a sweet headshot. Move, we haven't talked about him, but because his rifle doesn't make a nice big noise. Polk is on crits. 
Poke is on the crits. Interesting. Interesting. So we'll uh, get on that camp as soon as he gets that charge up all the way. But uh, yeah, like I said, Mufa's doing a good job too. You can see they're both uh, pretty up there in scores for snipers. And of course, then I get on Moof's cam, he's not going to be able to get anything. Um, finally, he does get that pick on Ivoronic, which will be significant because his combo is pushing in now. Again, they don't have this Uber, they don't have this crit, and Polk was alone on the second floor by himself. Kai just now coming up, not sure what's going on here. Maybe Kai missed the jump? I'm not exactly sure, uh, because you definitely don't want to send your medic into an area where there's a spun up... Uh, heavy. Who appears actually to be eating a sandwich and then he was rudely interrupted by a mail call from Wesley, but uh, don't worry, Altitude Cow has a bit of mail of his own. The mail, a rocket. Set to explode immediately. Alright, let's check in on Polk, see if he's uh, still running that crit. Uh, he is still on that crit, or you gotta be patient with this, guys. I'm not sure why they're pushing in without, uh, without that crit. And without any sort of like a player advantage uh, maybe they're thinking with heals advantage they could get in there and uh, as uh, Kai take more damage the crits would build faster and then the crits would be there and they wouldn't expect it or something like that but uh, regardless those past two pushes have not worked and it looks like they learned their lesson uh, crits has popped immediately let's see if it uh, catches anything it does take down pyro axe the pyro on the point but Polk goes down to a backstab Spacey was waiting for him oh so much of red is not well actually red does ha doesn't have terrible placement right now we're gonna have some heavy on heavy action oh but Zopper wasn't getting those heals Kai goes down but in comes Cyan who looks like will be able to set up a bunch of stickies to protect this area as nobody from 35th can get there JK here comes a scout who was bonked and didn't stop the cap and it looks like altitude cow got taken down in mid-air right there so the first round very very close round it goes to Hugh or attack on Hugh if I may say so. Anyway, these are the scores, and we'll be right back with the second half. Thank you, Hypnotoad, and now back to the action. So we do have 35th Infantry on defense first, and Taco on Taco attack on Hugh will uh, have the opportunity to set the time. Let's uh, hope that 35th doesn't. Uh, prematurely pop uber I feel like I, I know I can make a lot of jokes with that but I'm not going to but uh Sopper <laughs> gets hashtag medic pop during setup oh I call his medic out right there um but you know what? it didn't turn out to be that disastrous uh because they're able to hold for quite a bit of time on C and um uh, make that closer than it probably should have been because uh, everything going down on A immediately. I think Attack on Hugh could have maybe um, committed more to the push, um, but uh, they did do A and B simultaneously uh, and then just had a little bit of trouble with C. Anyway though, you see the different uh, methods and setup on engineers and uh, we'll see how it goes. Looks like uh, Uber is still intact. We are good to go ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Ibaronic going down immediately as CJC got in there to take him out so nice pressure keeps that sniper out of business. Zopper uh, going upstairs uh, putting down some spam but then he's gonna fall down to try to take out Kai right here and he does get the pick. Oh Kai, Uber's popped. Oh my goodness, uh, Uber popped right there to save to save Zopper, but was it worth it is the question. Now they're going to be at a severe uber disadvantage. Uh, a has yet to be capped. Uh, mostly because uh, Diamond is doing some nice work right here, taking down this mini sentry. <laughs> uh, getting support from his uh, from his sniper. We'll see if he can actually stop this. It looks like uh, Ibaronic did come in and take down the sniper. Now it's going to be Diamond versus Dell. Dell with some nice jump in action, but he's not going to be able to outrun the scout. And down goes Dell. Down the, down the dell? Uh, yeah, down the dell. That's a thing, right? Anyway. Uh, we do have this blue Uber popped, and Zed was nowhere near Uber, so he gets taken down. Uh, Zopper gallantly tries, tries to stay in there, but he's not going to be able to, and this is a really, really nice push out of attack on Hugh. Uh, need to get this upper ground, take out this altitude cow. He does get finished off and falls down, uh, so now attack on Hugh in a good position to, uh, again, cap A and B simultaneously if uh, A is clear. We do have a spy, but don't worry, Sacred Dragon was all on top of that. And so it looks like we will have this B cap before A. Is anybody at A? 
is the question. Um, it looks like Kai and Polk and uh, Demo Man Cyan are going to push up, which is absolutely the best thing to do right here. Prevent anybody from coming in uh, to attack B and just put those uh, poor left behind uh, classes on the point to get capped. Um, but they got to get A before they get C, so got to retreat his steps and get back to A. So we'll watch CJC as he tries to do that. And I am saying CJC, not DJC. And I'm still not completely 100% sure this is him, but I'm pretty sure, maybe. I know he and uh, Kai and Polk like to uh, play together. And um, they, yep, so we'll see. Anyway, uh, not able to get to the port right there. Uh, Diamond, oh man. We'll see if he can take it down this sniper with so little health that he does take down Moof. He's not going to escape Kai's bullets from her minigun, though. And uh, finally, Blue getting some presents back here on A. Uh, Red going to try their darndest to uh, to stop it. Altitude Car Cow does get the pick on Dell, but now he's uh, pretty uh, up the creek without a paddle. In fact, he's up the creek and only has uh, that equalizer, which is not going to do too much for him right now. See what Lou Louch is doing, but nope, just um, getting set up there on C. Not gonna get involved in this battle of A, because it looks like pretty much gone to Hugh right now, as 35th lost their medic, lost about half of their team. We'll see if Donald tries to do something interesting, but uh, he's gonna just get that teleport to the top of the top of the tower and uh, just try to set up for a long C defense. Now they did have a good defense on C first round. They put it five, six minutes, I believe. Uh, so we'll see if they can replicate that. That would buy them a lot of time right here because uh, three minutes and 14 seconds for the first two points is a pretty, pretty sweet time going on here for attack on Hugh. The Polk is on that regular Uber charge. So uh, sticking with the normal, well, I don't want to say normal, but the, uh... Oh, drop Zion, though! Oh, poor Zion gets blown up, and now Polk has to Uber the sniper. Moof certainly appreciates it, but it's not going to be the push they wanted to. Kai had fallen back, so she wasn't there. Oh, and now she's covered in urine and getting picked off! No! Diamond takes her down! At least Polk is still alive, but for how long? Spacey tries to come in, but, uh, nice protection right there from Sacred Dragon. And after all that, only five players up right now for uh, 35th Infantry. Blue's going to try to make their push, and it looks like they will succeed. Oh, man. The Louch just getting blown away. Uh, Donald is there trying his darndest. He does get 2k, but it's not going to be enough. And Attack on Hugh does get a sweet, sweet little nifty time of 4 minutes and 18 seconds. I, I want to spec Dell, because I want to know what he's doing. But uh, I know I've talked way too much about engineers already, so... Let's uh, let's watch Cyan and his defense, what he's going to do right here. Uh, we haven't really been looking at what's going on on defense on A, but my guess is he's going to set a sticky trap, uh, go to B, and then wait for someone to call it out, or at least uh, wait till he sees that somebody is capping A. Not sure about what that one is about. That's uh, pretty noticeable. I like, the, I like that one, because it looks... Uh, yeah, he don't notice that right away, but uh, he is... Now retreating back to A, like I said, so we'll see if he can't catch any flies with that honey. The honey, of course, being... Um, sticky traps. Sticky? Get it? Ha ha ha! Alright, but we'll stay on his camera because he is up here now. Uh, I'm just gonna spam down this opening, it looks like. Gotta watch out that he's already used quite a bit of ammo. Um, well, not quite a bit, but he's already used some and he can't get any ammo up there, but it's gonna fall back. Alright. Alright. We'll check on Yay and uh, this f A point A. Uh, we did have Spacey coming in there, and we did see the aftermath of those stickies, and we do see the aftermath of Spacey <laughs> getting blown up right there, so he knew exactly uh, when to denote detonate that. Uh, looks like a Donald tried to come in for a jump, but not able to do so. Um, uh, Dell's central gun took him out right there. Um, Casual, I'm not sure if he's gonna, what he's going to do right here, just again, just scouting and giving intelligence or maybe trying to make a move. Uh, Medic has not come out of his little hidey hole, so Zed doing pretty much a standard thing right there of waiting for his team to, um, to capture A before they all make a push through C to B. Well, pr usually it is through C. So we do see that teleporter. Uh, same thing going on here from Dell that we saw definitely Louch. <clears throat> which will give your team advantage, uh, height advantage on the uh, the roof, of course, which will prevent jumpers from the other team. 
We'll see, though. All right, so we do have this uh, combo and entire team pushing. Oh, Donald's running into some trouble. He's probably going to need this Uber. He does get the Uber popped. Uh, we'll see who outlasts because it is... Oh, Kai found the one player that wasn't Uber. And it is... Oh, Zopper got stuck in between a rock and a hard place and not able to do anything with that. Now Kai is just rolling through everyone with a little help from Cyan and some stickies and only two left alive after that push. Not a good push from 35th. Uh, they were just out of position and then Zopper got himself sandwiched in not a good way. Uh, probably could have used uh, Pyro... Pyro Axe, that's, I was going to say Axe Pyro, but no, that's not right. Pyro Axe, um, maybe a little more air blasting, but he was caught out in the corner by Kai pretty uh, early on in the engagement. So not able to do too much right there. Meanwhile, Zed stayed alive, so that is good news for 35th. They're going to have about equal Ubers, but uh, bad news is they only have about two minutes to capture B and C, and B captures like molasses, like a sloth through molasses. It takes forever. So we'll see. We will see if they're going to be able to do this. Definitely possible, but uh, they're running out of the uh, probability. Moof getting a nice shot there. Oh! Can he finish off anybody with this? No, he's instead going to be M1 to death. And uh, Pyrax takes him out. Meanwhile, Altitude Count is being a little M1 himself. He is still on fire. Will he survive? What's he going to do? What's he going to do? I think he's going to burn to death. No, he's found some health. There you go. Oh, but no, it was damage was called out and Casual came in to finish him off and then disappeared into the dusk. Uh, casual with a nice pick right there. All right. Lelouch just got a, uh, a, ring, or, uh, a fist kill right there on... Um, oh, sorry, I'm just laughing because those are so rare. Even in pubs, you never get those on, on CJC who said it was a nice pick right there. But anyway, Pulp does go down. Uh, only 60 seconds left. I'm not really sure if this is possible right now. Oh, Donald is trying his best, but he can't do it alone. He really needs the support of his team right there. Uh, it looks like they were not pushing at the same time he was, so this coordinated action is just not coming through for 35th. They almost have this Uber, but their medic is so unprotected, and no Zed pulls out the needles. He is not going to make it out of this alive, and down he goes. Kai makes sure of that. Uh, she is left with uh, about half health, but she is still spun up and ready for more blood. Uh, you can tell. Fierce. Absolutely fierce right there. Uh, Donald again trying to make something happen, but he goes down now with Polk up. It's going to be very, very difficult for 35th to get anybody on B, let alone C. I mean, of course they could have somebody quick capping C, but uh, looks like right now B is their big concern and it's not going to happen. Only 10 seconds left. Attack on Hugh, being very aggressive. Don't want to let them get anywhere in here. A guy has found most of the team. She goes down, but not without taking uh, Zed Cool with her. And that will be the end of the game. These are your final scores. Attack on Hugh with a nice, a nice first round. And that really is a nice first half of the second round. And that's what sealed the deal with them. Uh, a push of under five minutes is beautiful. And uh, 35th really couldn't do anything to overcome that. So here are your final scores. Um, like I said, I love the sniper work. Uh, looks like Moof had a little bit of bigger round this half. Um, but uh, Ironic was going pretty big uh, first round. Love the engineer work. Louch and uh, Del Connor. Del Conagher are no slouches. Uh, but we're losing players rapidly, and that's the sign I gotta go. Quick shout out to Sacred Dragon, who did a great job protecting his medic. Uh, Polk, that is, and Kai, who's fearless. Also, shout out to 35th Infantry, who uh, will always have a special place in my heart. They know why. Anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching. Thanks to Del, who sent this to me. Glad I could finally cast something with him in it. Uh, anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching, and have a good day.